What's going guys, Dennis here and today in this video of Excess Heroes, I'm presenting to you this guide on how to transcend your Fate Core hero units by using the original normal copy of that same hero unit, alright? So let's get this started. So, for example, I already have this Anastasia right over here, right? Which I have been using for a lot of my contents because she is obviously a wonderful healer indeed. And now, Today, I came to <laughs> summon a Fate Core Anastasia. And now, I would really love to transcend. I would really love to utilize this moment and transcend my Anastasia, my Fate Core Anastasia, by using the base Anastasia. But now, the problem is, my original Anastasia is at 57 level. And damn, oh damn, I have already spent a lot of experience scrolls in getting her to level 57. <laughs> She's not level 57 just like that. A lot of experience scrolls were being, you know, sacrificed. And now I would not really want to let that sacrifice to go into the vein. And now right over here, I have level 1 Fate Core Anastasia. Can I just transcend her right off the bat by using the original Anastasia? Can it be wise to do that? Because like if I use the original Anastasia to transcend her right at the bat, I mean like she's just gonna stuck at level 1, <laughs> right? And I have to again feed her all those experience scrolls just like that over and over again and try to get her to the level 57, level 60 or maybe level 75 and it can be really really hurtful indeed. I mean like all those experience scrolls that I've been uh, really feeding to my original Anastasia, I mean like that was meant for nothing, right? And that could really be hurtful. Now, what could be the solution for this matter? Now, I'm going to tell it to you guys. But first, let's talk about the transcending factor. Because like sometimes there can be a little bit of error when it comes to transcending. Even though you have a dupe, a copy of that particular unit, but you still cannot proceed with the transcendence. There can be an error. Just look at it. When I click the transcend, the Anastasia is not showing up right over here. It just says there is no hero spirit to choose. Like what? Hey, this can be quite... Confusing for so many players out there, especially for the beginners. And they have been quite asking me this question a lot lately in my YouTube comments, okay? And that's that. So I really want to teach you guys on how it can be done very easily. So right over here, guys, let's go into the original Anastasia. Right off the bat, just like this. And can you see the P icon? You know, the letter P icon on the top left corner of her main icon? Just look at that. The P refers to that C is playing somewhere else in the game content, okay? As long as C is busy in some other content of the game, C won't be able to be used or consumed, okay? So that's the thing right over there. That means like C is not gonna appear when you really want to transfer. But now the thing is that it might be quite very tricky to find out like what is she exactly being hired where is she exactly being active i mean like there can be multiple contents in this game where she can be really uh, active right <laughs> so how to know that right away so can you just see right over here this icon like it's kind of like seems to be like a compass you know the compass needle just click on that one and right off the bat you will be able to see that like C is right now active in Zebin's Tanya, the PvP battle of this game. If I just take her out from there, now C will be able to be consumed. Okay, so let's get this on. Let's get back into the Zebin's Tanya. First of all, let's go to the world. And in the world, we can go into the challenge on the right corner. And let's go into the Zebin's Tanya right over here, PvP tank. Just move into it. And let's try to change our team so that like she is gonna go out, all right? So right over here, the Anastasia is right over here, right? So instead of Anastasia, I will just put Talia, okay? Because she is also a really good healer. And I will just go back into my main uh, airship, <laughs> all right? And right now, my uh, Anastasia should already be free, right? Okay, that was the wrong selection, not in the team, <laughs> in the management heroes. And in the management heroes, now you can see that my Anastasia don't have that P icon on the top left of her main icon anymore. That means like, she is not playing anywhere, she is not active anywhere. And you can see that her compass has disappeared as well. Now this is the clear indication that she can be consumed now, okay? And the next thing that you also need to keep in mind that 
she should be unlocked before you can use her or consume her as a transcending material okay or let's say any kind of fusion material as well so please make sure you unlock her as well now after doing all those kind of things when you click to transcend your fate core anastasia see the anastasia is there okay there just look at that now i can use her but is this a right decision to do I mean like, am I going to really sacrifice my level 57 <laughs> Anastasia to just give it to my level 1 Fate Core Anastasia? Is this gonna be quite a really good move? I would say hell no. No, no, don't do it like this way because I have already invested a lot of experience scroll into my original Anastasia and I really don't want that to go to waste. So what I can do is... Let's click on the main Fate Core Anastasia right over here, the level 1 Fate Core Anastasia that I just pulled a while ago. And let's click on our Fate Core right over here. And after that one, right over here, let's unequip the Fate Core. Okay, now I have unequipped the Fate Core. You can pretty much change the appearance as well just from right over here. No problem at all. Yes, you can change the appearance while still keeping the fate core uh, ability okay for right now she is now the meaning like the fate core anesthesia that i just pulled a while ago has now turned into a normal anesthesia all right and now let's get back into my original anesthesia who was level 57 right and now what i can do is now i can equip that fate core on my original anesthesia okay so just look at that equip see Look at that! My original Anastasia has now level 57 and she also has the Fate Core equipped! Isn't that great? Now what I can do? I can pretty much transcend! Just look at it! Look at it guys! Level 57 trans uh, and like Anastasia is going to be my original source and this Fate Core Anastasia that I just pulled a while ago, I just unequipped that Fate Core and now she has turned into a normal Anastasia and now I will keep my level 57 and I will still be able to transcend my fate core Anastasia and let's transcend why not okay do you want to transcend the selected hero you will permanently lose the hero used as material I would say like hell yeah why not of course please sure make it happen and boom there we go maximum level increased by two plus one to the transcendence and her level is 57 as well boom there we go <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! See? Now my Fate Core Anastasia is of level 57 as that of my original one and she is transcended by plus one. There we go, that's how it's done. Wasn't it that easy? And the next tip is that there were some players who were pretty much asking like can I still keep the Fate Core while using my original avatar, original skin because I really don't like this skin. Like there were some people out there, I mean obviously this skin is much better in my opinion, she looks more waifu type, right? So all you can do is just click on this uniform button right over here and just click on this uniform. See? Even though she is a fate core unit, she still can have her original costume, original skin or let's say original avatar while still having the fate core, uh, you know like the ability, okay? Just look into her skills right over here, just look at that. That's her fate core skills, right? So look, look at this, look at this. I mean like you are still in love with the main original skin or avatar then you can just change the uniform or you can just turn it back just like that. Too easy, no problem at all. So this is it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button to keep on enjoying the contents of my channel. See you guys in the next video.